we're going to watch Jesus' story. Even I'm eating ice cream, I cannot eat there. Yeah, you cannot eat inside. Yeah, you cannot eat inside. During the play, it's an activity play by City Impact Church. Because if you look at the TV and they are singing and nobody is eating there. And nobody is eating inside. So why are we eating here? Yeah, that's why here you can still eat. Get inside now. That's why you have to finish your food faster so we can... So we can go inside now. Okay, are you excited? No, it doesn't tell you. Yeah. Really, I believe really they're doing this. Oh, look at this. You can wait to watch the show. They say it's one and a half hour play. One and a half. different Christian churches. Actually, the entrance fee is free. This place is no way. Hey guys, you can Thank you. 
those who embraced him and took hold of his name, given the authority to become who they really are, the sons of God.
be a paper so some of you just come over down here, Will. Yeah. No, what is it? Get it back there, come on! Oi, oi, oi. Oh, oh, oh. Oi! Watch where you're going! You must be Wolf! Sorry about that. Nice to meet you. Oh, you're the new guys. Yup, we're the Dave. It, you're both called Dave. Okay then, Dave too. Close to five, almost closing time, fellas. Oh, not for me, Murray. Are you doing the nice just a game, Walt? Yup. But it's Christmas Eve. <laughs> yup. Five minutes to yard and factory shutdown. I repeat, five minutes to shut down. Five minutes, Murray. I can see now that this place is crazy messy. You better get these people to hurry up. I can't believe I have to do this for minimum wage. You're just making more of a mess! Oh, Walter, stop being so grumpy. Oh, Walter's always grumpy. How can he be grumpy at Christmas time? Yeah, it's Christmas. Ain't that right, Walt? Well, you see, it's a bit more complicated than it sounds. Shingle bells are ringing.
I will not see the outdoors tonight.
you could ever imagine. Hi, I'm Danny the Young, nice to meet you. And this is my friend Frosty, the Stone Man. Oh, oh, don't worry, he may be freezing, but he has a warm heart. Ahem, these are our friends, the Tin Soldiers. And this is Willy Wonka. Merry Christmas, Walt. Nothing like a good Wonka bar on Christmas Eve. Here, take this and keep it in your pocket. <laughs> That's enough, Willie. Anyway, help me. <laughs> this is Santa Claus. You know him, surely. Over there in the corner is Little Jack Corner. And those down there are some sugar plum fairies. And um, that is a giant camel we just can't get rid of every year. And he spits on everyone. Yes, this is true, sadly. He's disgusting. <laughs> also, those are a bunch of smelly orphan kids. <laughs> and this is the Grinch, who stole Christmas, and with the Morris favourite, who's from Whoville. Those down there are three lost, ridiculously cute angels. And these are my colleagues. Joe, Janice, Jackie, Jocelyn, Jolene, and Greg. Hi! <laughs> and these guys here are. Ahem! No one introduces me. Only me introduces me. Okay. My name is me. Oh, uh, I mean Maximus. This is my brother, Minimalist. Minimalist? But, but he's so much bigger than. <laughs> I see. We're Robin mercenaries. Seriously, anything you need, anyone you need to get rid of, if you know what I mean, you just let us know. <laughs> uh, please take no notice of those two, my dear Walt. They try to act tough, but deep down they really are just a couple of softies. So, why are you here? Of course, that's enough about us. The great owner says you have an empty tank. Excuse me, oh, Christmas cheer. You have done. We're here to fill you up, to help you fall in love with Christmas. <laughs> Put him in the chair, cheers. Give him what they Thank <laughs> you. 
looking for signs in the stars would know the place where Jesus was born. And that's not all. There's even stories of thousands of angels appearing to people in the fields. The young girl had no idea how special her baby really was.
brought the kids out night after night, after night, and sat through while well, they were rehearsing. I want to thank all the parents. You know, the amazing thing is, this is a whole new generation here at City Impact Church producing this and, and helping it out. And, you know, some of their parents weren't even born. Their parents weren't born when Bev and I pioneered this church 40 years ago. So it's like a whole new generation. And I just want to say thank you so much to everybody. I know uh, some of you would know there's a lot of work behind the scenes, all the sound, the production, all the stage hands. It's just amazing, as I said, how much work. This is our third performance. And I do just honor you and thank you so much for coming out tonight. I really, really do appreciate it as well. And uh, you know, I'm just, uh, just up here amazed. I was watching the little kids teaching the, the little, little kids, you know, their moves. And I just think it's so awesome. So, so thank you so much for, I know so much work and effort goes into this. Uh, a lot of people don't realize this is what a church can do. All that footage is City Impact Churches of a shot and produced in the whole script and so forth in house. I'm so proud of everybody. And I'm so proud of our new lead pastors talking about from one generation to another. Because I'm in the stage of Walt's kind of life, and I'm so proud tonight to introduce to you our new lead pastors here at City Impact Church. Now, of course, they've been introduced to the church, but I know a lot of the community people are here who come year in, year out. I'm going to now hand it over to Pastor John and come up here, you guys. And thank you so much. Thank you, Pastor. Hey, I don't know about you, but I absolutely love that. I've watched it about seven times and it gets better and better every time. And uh, you know, there's so much time and effort that goes into this because to us here at City Impact Church, Christmas is one of our favorite times of the year. We love it. And uh, the reason being is I'm sure it was conveyed in tonight's uh, spectacular is that it's so much more to us than just a day of presents. It's, it's a day when the greatest gift ever given to mankind was given he arrived on this earth and you saw the story and you know it would be wrong for me to close tonight without uh we, we do have one more finale number by the way so just hold on for a second uh but it'd be wrong for me to close tonight without giving you the opportunity to respond to the heart and the message that is behind this show you may have noticed that crate the crate number was 316 316 and for us that was based off perhaps the most famous scripture from the bible john 3 16 and it says this it says for god so loved the world he gave his only son that who would ever believe in him shall not perish but shall have everlasting life god's heart is on christmas time is that you would understand the gift that jesus was to all of mankind in fact the great news